Howdy you lovely people, welcome back to the channel. I hope you're all having a fantastic day. This pedal, man. This is the pedal which basically did that tone which you just heard. And uh, lots of you actually went and checked out my previous video um, a while back, which was every single riff and some solos from White Snake 1987. That was such a blast to do. And um, I got a good few questions about, hey, how did you get the Sykes tone? <laughs> That's how I got the Sykes tone. This was actually designed by my friend Alex Bayrod from Primal Fear and Voodoo Circle. And um, he has a company called Guitar Slinger. And he does pedals and vintage guitar parts and stuff. And this is one of the pedals in his lineup. It's called the 87 Mark III. Why is it called the 87 Mark III? Well, White Snake 1987. Yeah. Mark III because Mesa Boogie Coliseum, which was basically a Mesa Boogie amp with a uh, Mark III amp with a 200 watt power amp. Yeah, because everyone needs 200 watts, right? They need the headroom. And it was basically used by John Sykes on the uh, White Snake album 1987. Really, really simple pedal. It's basically got three knobs, a volume, a gain, and a presence knob and one switch which actually switches in more bass or less bass so that you can get a thicker sound or a thinner sound. Works really well with uh, strats because then you can thicken up the single core sounds. actually pretty versatile as well you can actually turn it down and just get a little bit of hair so when I was playing some of the clean parts like on uh, the backing for the solo to um, is this love I used my strap and I basically had this way down the, the the gain was way down so that you know it just gave a tiny bit of a push but still kept it very 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 super clean now save for the strap part I played everything on my wonderful vintage V100 AFD guitar which I got recently and I love that guitar. It's, just, it's killer man! <laughs> you just heard it! <laughs> it plays so well. I'm so glad I got that. I had wanted one for a while. I did a review of that guitar way 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 back um, when I didn't have the grey beard basically. <laughs> and I've wanted one since. Awesome guitar. 10.3 pounds weight though that's like 4.6 kilos it's heavy but that tone and combined with this pedal basically I was able to get that Sykes vibe One of the special things about this pedal is that it was designed by my friend Alex Bayrod from Primal Fear and Voodoo Circle. Now, he actually sat down with producer Keith Olsen in an LA studio in the mid 1990s and listened to the master tapes from 1987, the White Snake album. Yeah, he got to listen to John Sykes' guitar tones straight from the master tapes. Yeah, so basically when he dialed this in, when he was designing the pedal, he had that tone in his ear and he was basically able to recreate his version of that tone. And I think he did a fantastic job. It's a really good pedal, very, very simple, 
love the sound of it, plug in and play, not too many knobs and stuff, you, you basically just get a tone, has a very very specific mid-range which punches through. And as you can hear when I'm playing the tracks, it really comes through, the guitars are so clear, every note is very very clear. The note clarity was fantastic even on the complicated chords that I was playing. It's a very very smooth sounding pedal as well uh, rather than it being kind of gritty like a Marshall-esque sound because it's based on a Mesa Boogie it's very silky smooth and you'll hear that when I play you the solo for Is This Love. Now my signal chain was very very simple, it was basically my guitar going straight into the pedal, pedal going into the clean channel of my slow drag amp which is a custom built Soldano SLO and then basically into my DAW and I used my Hero Cabs signature IR packs, the green cabs basically based on green backs and I got that tone. It was wonderful to play, really loved it. Alright guys and girls, here's some more 1987 for you, I love playing all of these tracks. All with this pedal, I'll flash up the uh, settings I did for each of the tracks as well so that you can see what I did with this. Enjoy and I'll see you really soon with another video. See you later, bye!